Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. This is going to be just a quick video on how I created this design that I placed in on a Starbucks cup on a previous video that I did. Um, if you want to watch that video where I created this cup um, from start to finish, I will go ahead and link that on the video description. So if you're interested, on how, interested in how I created the design, um, go ahead and keep watching. So the website where I'm going to get the design is um, clipart.email. That's the website where I usually get all my images from. And I'm going to search um, Monarch Butterfly. And I'm going to find one that I like. This is the one that I'm going to be using right here. I like to use this website because they usually have clean images that are easy to clean up and I don't have to do any extra work. So this is the butterfly that I'm going to be using here and all you have to do is click on it. Sorry for my dirty um, computer screen. I obviously need to clean it. Um, and you're just going to click where it says save and that's going to go ahead and save it to your computer. You're then going to open up design space and go ahead and click where it says upload and upload image and browse and look for the image that you saved. So once you have your image uploaded, you're going to go ahead and click simple and then continue. You're going to repeat the step twice just because this is going to be a double layer um, decal or design that you're going to have. So you're first going to just go ahead and save the entire image just like this without cleaning anything up. That way you can have a background color. So you're going to click um, next. I am going to take off those letters at the bottom. That way I don't have to take it off later on. You can just go ahead and click erase and click the make the thing bigger and just kind of erase that off and click continue and just save it as a cut image. So then now you have your image uploaded already and you're going to again upload the image again. You're going to um, browse it and then upload it and then click simple and then again just zoom out. And then now you're going to clean up all the, the middle parts of the image. And then this part of the... Um, the design is going to be black and then the one that we saved earlier is going to be whatever your your inside color is going to be like either the rose gold or whatever color you choose your butterfly to be. So you can also do the little circles, but um, I didn't want to do that. I didn't want I didn't want the circles, so I just saved it without them. I am going to go ahead and take off those letters off the bottom. And then continue and then just save it as a cut image and then click save and then you're going to go ahead and insert both um, images to your design space. I don't know why they uploaded so big but you can just go ahead and shrink them. The size that I usually size them to fit on the Starbucks cup is usually 1.1 for the width and then 1.1 for the height. And I go ahead and do that to, for both of them. Make them the same size, resize them to 1.1 for the height and then 1.1 for the width. I'll go ahead and zoom in right now, that way they can appear bigger and you'll be able to see what I'm doing. So now that they're resized to 1.1 and 1.1, you are going to change this one just so that, that way you can see what's, what color each one's going to be. The background, you just change it to whatever the inside of the butterfly is going to be. Um, for the cup that I did, I did a rose gold, so I just made it pink and then the other one stayed black. And then you just kind of go ahead and duplicate the image. You highlight it and then duplicate it up on the right hand side. And then just make as many as you want to put on your cup. I usually do about four or five.
I'm also going to be showing you guys how I um, slice the um, design to go ahead and perfectly fit one like around here how I did on my Starbucks cup what you do is you go ahead and insert a shape a circle and then you resize it to the exact measure um, dimensions of the um, Starbucks logo which is 2.125 for the width and then two for the height and then you kind of just place it where you would want to place it on your Starbucks logo. And what you're going to do is you're going to slice the butterfly by highlighting both images and then clicking slice way at the bottom. And then you remove this and you go ahead and erase those two. And then you kind of do the same thing for the other piece. You insert the circle. You resize it to the dimensions of the Starbucks logo. And then you kind of just um, go ahead and group those together how they would normally, how you're going to be putting them together. And then you put the circle there um, perfectly fitting where it's going to be sliced and then you remove the black part since that part is already sliced and then you highlight both of them and then you go ahead and click slice at the bottom and then go ahead and just delete those parts and there you go and then you can move that into the to the front by clicking arrange and move forward and there you have your um, butterfly that's going to be cut out and then you just go ahead and click make it and your machine will cut it out for you. Thanks so much for watching. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to ask.